The Morgan Park Mustangs baseball program is getting a long-awaited upgrade. This is their 103-year-old baseball field. It's about to be redone to the thrill of everyone involved. Derek shows us it might help reverse a trend. On a recent weekday afternoon, the Mustangs took on the Kennedy Crusaders. But they were battling their own field as well. All that stuff right there. The coaching staff works hard to make the field playable, but the needs are obvious. Players have to be careful because there are lots of hazards to avoid. If a guy steps in here, that's an ACL, his career could be over with. Or if he dives and hits that, it could be very dangerous. The upgrades will be paid for by an $87,000 donation from the Chicago Cubs charities. It's expected to cover a new infield, dugouts, partial outfield, and hopefully work to the bullpen and batting cages. The new field won't be ready for graduating seniors, but they're thrilled too. I'm happy for the younger classes coming up because they, they can be excited playing on a new field. Kyle is headed to St. Louis University on a baseball scholarship after this season. Baseball is important at Morgan Park, but education comes first. And for African-American boys, basketball or football are often the preferred sport. The NBA draft is coming up. They publicize that real big. You see Zions everywhere. Uh, Michael Jordan was everywhere. The NFL, uh, they publicized that really big. The donation for Newfield is part of the Diamond Project Initiative, which expands opportunities for youth in underserved communities to play baseball and softball. Black player representation in Major League Baseball was over 18% in the mid-80s, but is now down to less than 7%. Probably what they need to do is maybe take some of their African-American players and really push them out uh, marketing-wise. Now the players can't wait for the new field to be completed. Very excited. I went home and jumped, screamed, because it's a blessing to get a new field. I've been playing this field since I was a little boy, practicing with travel ball. It's like sixth grade, fifth grade. I finally get to see it new. It's going to be great. So I'm excited. They're excited. Boy energy is always exciting. Eventually, they'll need bleachers, netting to stop foul balls, a scoreboard and press box, and the entire outfield will ultimately be redone. They're applying for another grant and asking for alumni to help out with that as well.